Mm -mm. Absolutely not. No way. Mm -mm. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing so well. For today's video, I am finally trying the two times spicy ramen challenge. I know I'm very late to the challenge and that's my fault. I ordered the wrong thing like a couple of weeks ago. I didn't know it was two times spicy. I just like chose the spicy one. So we ended up eating it like normal ramen and I did find it was quite tasty. But I finally got my hands on the two times spicy one. So I already boiled my noodles. It's getting a little bit hard because it's sitting in the AC for a while. I have the sauce and a little seasoning. So yeah, if you want to see me try this uh, spicy ramen challenge, although I don't have a timer, then keep on watching. So I'm going to add the sauce. Ooh, it's spicy. I am so excited for this because I love spicy food. Most of my friends know that I eat like raw pepper, scorpion pepper, any kind of hot pepper basically with my food. I just love pepper a lot. So I don't know. We'll see how this one goes. Hopefully I don't die. Oh boy, but I'm trying to do this really quick because it's like really early in the morning and <laughs> it's the only time I have some quiet time in this house. So, got a little sauce in my hand. I wanted to taste it. It's actually quite tasty. I didn't taste anything spicy. Okay. Just like to have a clean plate now, boy. Okay, so I have some milk, Nestle, not sponsored. And my glass. So let me pour this out. Or should I? Next thing I'd, I waste it. I'm not going to pour it out. So, this is what we're looking like so far. And I'm gonna give this a little mix with my spoon and fork. See how it goes. It's smelling really good actually. Give this a little quick mix. Well, how y'all going? Y'all ever try this um, ramen? This is a lot. Honestly, I'm such a little that I can't eat a whole pack of ramen so I really should have leave back some for my brother to taste, you know. Man. But I'm too lazy to get up and go get a bowl and like take out some for him. <laughs> and I was really lucky too because this was like the last pack I found in a Chinese grocery in Curep. I really went in for um, snacks. Um, they have like these really nice soft pillowy kind of biscuits filled with chocolate and I went back for it they didn't have and I just said you know what let me check the ramen aisle and see if they have this and this was the last pack and it was like hidden in between a bunch of other ramen so I'm like did somebody pretend or plan to hide this because I found you okay this is a lot of ramen I feel like I should definitely leave back some oh well oh boy so we ready and the thing is y'all know is always about truth and honesty on this channel and i see some people doing like they're dying with this thing so i mean not trying to downplay anybody reaction but like how spicy this damn noodles could really be like you die and i see people tap out they're like uh-uh but i will say though if i don't finish it it's not because too spicy it's just that this is a lot of food for me like candace my best friend if you're watching this girl you know this is too much food for me so i'll force i'll force and see if i could eat it mind you it is like 11 o'clock in the morning anyway i'm talking too much let me just take my first bite but first i need to take a thumbnail okay now for the moment of truth let's see what everybody getting on for Well, I was disappointed. I legit wanted to feel like I died. <laughs> this tastes like if 
I put mild pepper sauce. Like, you know the kind of pepper sauce you give you when you go to restaurants? I can't believe this. This can't be the ramen. This had to be a mistake. Two times spicy. Sam Yang is the brand. Yeah, this is it. Did I buy the wrong one? Because I'm not feeling anything. Like, it has a slight kick to it. Nothing. I think I, I have like a, a little five-year-old nephew around who could eat this. Mm-mm. Oh yeah. Mm -mm. Absolutely not. No way. Mm -mm. Hell to the no. This cavity ramen. All you need to tell me if this is it. Is this is this the two times spicy ramen? This is the two times spicy ramen. This is the name. What the brand name? This is the brand name here, yes, Samyang. Is this it? Did I buy the correct one? I don't feel like it is. It can't be because this. It tastes like the regular ones that they have because you know they have some regular flavors like hot chicken. They have um. Like a cheese flavor. I can't believe this is what people were dying over. I I really think this this can be it. This can be it. Mm mm. Well, at least y'all get an ex mukbang. <laughs> And it's actually quite tasty too. So, I think if I had some slices of chicken in here, or maybe like a thick a chicken thigh. Mm. That would lash. I want to leave back some for my brother to taste it, but a juta it already, now boy. Oh, let's say juta. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong, eh? it's spicy, but I don't, in my opinion, I don't think it warrants the reactions that I saw. But I can't say if you are someone who not accustomed to spice, and I feel like the Caribbean palette is just all about spice, so I think we would do well with this challenge. Although I did some, I did see some Trini people just like fully freak out over this and like give up and i'm like all right cool everybody's spice level different but like, definitely my best friend she can't eat this mm -mm. she will not be able to tolerate this but honestly it's not bad <laughs> at all so y'all please let me know if i got the wrong um spicy noodles because i feel like i did I started to get full. Mind you, this is breakfast. Eh? Like I said, it's like 11 in the morning right now. But it is really tasty. As you can see, I'm sweating on my nose. Which is typical for me when I eat in spicy food. But I honestly thought like I was gonna feel this all in my chest and be like, oh my god, like no, I can't eat it. I was really excited for that reaction. For the fact that I eaten this, like if it's just regular spicy food, it's not exciting me. <laughs> I am happy that it's um clearing my sinus. So if you have nasal congestion, <laughs> eat a spicy ramen. I 
out of bad mind I'm trying to eat all this food out there. Don't think I'm greedy. But I have like half a plate left. I don't think I could finish it. It's a lot of food when I get real full. And I don't want to feel sick after because I have so much things to do today. Right. Right now I have all online here because mommy and daddy go on grocery. And I think this is the first time since the pandemic my parents went out together and I am so nervous. I feel like the parent now because I like want to call them every 10 minutes to see where they are and what they're doing. Making sure their masks fixed properly and not too close to people because like it was this week. Um, yeah, daddy and I had to go look for a faucet for the bathroom vanity sink because the one that we have right now it broke And it just like have water running so water kind of wasting right now and When we went like to the different um Showrooms looking for faucets I had to like put my hand on daddy's t-shirt and just like be pulling them like get too close to people All right, and he's like all right, all right He's just kind of forget, you know, I mean, going out in this pandemic, especially when you're old. I just kind of forget the rules sometimes. So I just have to like, pull them back. Excuse me. Yeah. So, like that, I feel like the parent now. Especially when, I don't know what it was, but like... When I hit 30, I legit feel like I definitely became the parent in this house now because parents be doing the most the boy, they just harden. I have a little sauce so much in it. <laughs> Anything in. With this, I legit thought that I would get like some free lip plumping action going on like just to show you how extra it is I was gonna put on lip gloss thinking it's gonna plump my lip and I am really disappointed with this really am but don't get me wrong it does have a kick like my mouth is burning because it's like spicy but it's so tolerable like I tell any children can eat this at least some children I know one who like pepper, that's what I should say. We should eat this. I don't know if it's good for the stomach, but I just say we can tolerate it. Again, real full all your like. Ooh. I have like this much left. I did well. Like if my best friend watching this, she would be so proud that I ate so much today. What I should I do? Is like not eat whole day so I could eat it out. But like I said, it's just so noisy these days. Because our neighbor at the back, they're doing some work. Um, so they were doing like a lot of welding and stuff. And yeah, like that's real noise. Plus it have some construction going on opposite us. So... That's noisy too. So, I had to film this like when I get the quiet time, you know. But I had to go and pop lunch now. And you get real come on camera time, you know what? This thing looking like it could be real hot. I might die, so I'm not going to put on any makeup and then because. I was just like, you go and put on a set of makeup to sweat it off and like wipe it off. Makes no sense. So I come up with my bare face, which I don't mind. <laughs> it's less time for me to get ready. But um, yeah, this was a little underwhelming. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Let me. But I'm happy for the um, the congestion. Oh well, look, I just have a little bit left. I'll eat it out, I'll eat it out. Oh 
Oh no. I let this so aside like touch my nose and now it's burning. Strange enough it's not burning my lips like like maybe just slightly here but I wanted a little more action that way. I feel like I feel that most at the let me see hold on at the back of my throat like I could feel the heat there and maybe like a slighting on my mouth <laughs> like ah, it sucks <laughs> I wanted to die well like in a dark way okay relax But um I saw another place selling the um the Packies one chip challenge. Like you know they came up with a new one, a twenty twenty one version. Should I try it? I really thought about it. But then I saw it was like a hundred and ten TT dollars for one chip. I'm like why? But I don't know how much try it. If y'all want me to try it, the Packies One Chip Challenge, let me know in the comments down below. And you go go organize it. Only I feel it real full. I can't make, I really force and eat a lot of food. I can't make. It's just too much noodles. It, that's a lot of food. My belly full. Um, I could do with a little glass of milk now. To wash this down but you see how tolerable this is like i'm not like <laughs> but there is some like heat i can definitely feel it like yeah but not like dying i've definitely had pepper sauce that hotter than this and some um it should be enough and um, what do you call it like mother-in-law if you eat mother-in-law when you go to prayers and stuff 10 times hotter than this so if you have a high tolerance for pepper you will get through this challenge this is this wasn't no challenge for me to be honest the challenge was finishing the food because it's a lot should i really leave back some for my brother cheese No drink good boy. Again, let me show all yeah, I was how prepared I was. I had like a snack here thinking like I would be dying because you know you could dip these in the chocolate, the Nutella chocolate. Thinking I saw so thinking that this was going to throw me on the floor. And here I am just sipping milk. Mm. That milk make me just thirsty for water. But um I like how we're going back any people noodles. <laughs> it tasty, I ain't gonna lie. Like I could just just up with a little boiled egg, some Chinese style chicken, what again? Green onion, some basil. I said basil. <laughs> I meant basil because I watch uh, Marianne's Kitchen. She's like my favorite chef. Um, if you want, I'll leave her channel link down below because literally, she's make the best meals. Like very complicated Vietnamese Thai food. So simple. Like I just, I just love her, and she loved to fry chicken and that. I'm like, yes, queen. Um, she says basil all the time too. <laughs> this is really tasty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I didn't want this video to be so long, but 
Oh well. I feel so proud. I feel like I need um a reward. I did well. <sighs> and that's a spicy challenge, people. Um, although I didn't really have a time or anything. Um this was just not as spicy as I expected it to be. Again, please make sure and let me know if I bought the right noodles because I, I, I don't see how this is like the big hype. But um yes, it is spicy, it does have a kick to it, but it is absolutely doable. <laughs> so anyway, that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching me enjoy this little spicy ramen challenge. If you did like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up it would really help out my little channel and don't forget to comment down below if this was the spicy ramen did you try it let like, you know and don't forget if you are new i would really appreciate if you could subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so that you are notified when i upload new videos every wednesday and sunday so you guys make sure and take care of yourselves i will see you all very soon bye